My name's Jubilee. I blow stuff up. Hello again, X-Men fans. Today I'll be reviewing Marvel Legends Jubilee by Hasbro from 2019. I got this on eBay with a buy it now price of $33 plus shipping. Time to open it up. This figure is just below six inches tall. Articulation, leg upwards, outwards, swivel the upper thigh, double jointed in the knee, swivel her upper boot, ankle movement, and pivot the ankle, waist left and right, and also upper chest swivels left and right, arms outwards, upwards, swivel the elbow, and hand movement. Uh, this hand mold only goes up and down, whereas this one only goes side to side. Head, even with her jacket, she can still look way left, way right, way down, and way up. Her appearance is good. I like her head and hair sculpt. I like her facial expression, paint application. There are no paint blemishes. Her earrings are accurate. I like her sunglasses, and she comes with more and another head sculpt, but we'll talk accessories later. But just to note, on this particular head sculpt, her sunglasses are not removable. The rest of her is also good. I like the color of her jacket, however it is missing the very top buttons, and it is also missing the belt on the back. However, I do like its overall length, and the sleeves are rolled up. Her shirt is a good color pink, with the proper stripe going down, and the emblem. She's got her shorts rolled up and at a proper correct length with the black belt, but the belt buckle is supposed to be a gold. Um, and we finally have a Jubilee with blue boots. Now, does anyone else see a problem here? I have recently watched every season of X-Men, and even I didn't notice this at first. Her gloves. They are blue, and they're supposed to be yellow, as they're seen throughout the entire season. How'd they make that mistake? Accessories, you will get one extra head sculpt, and these glasses are removable, or you can even just put them upwards and they stay into place. And then you get just another set of sunglasses, my guess is in case you happen to lose them. And finally, you will get the main torso piece, build a figure of Caliban. I loved X-Men the Animated Series as a kid. I had as many original figures and playsets as possible, but they never made a Jubilee until 1995. She was a main character since episode 1. How can you not make a figure of her? That's like making a line of Ninja Turtle figures without a splinter or a krang. Sadly, Jubilee has not had many action figures made of her. The Gen X had its major share of problems including its awkward posability and not being accurate to the animated series at any point in the entire trilogy. You could say this particular action figure is her first true rendition. It's still not perfect, but as of this date, it's the best for now. And that wraps up my review. Please stay tuned for some still pictures and videos. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and comment, and check me out on Patreon so I can keep doing reviews like this. Thanks again for watching, and I'll see you next time.